Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to upgrade the RAM in a 14 inch iBook G4. Start by powering down the iBook. Now unplug any cables and the charger. Using a small flathead screwdriver, rotate the keyboard lock to the unlocked position. This position can be different on each laptop. Now pull back on the two spring loaded clips. While pulling them back, slowly pull the keyboard up. This takes a little bit of gentle force as there are magnets holding the keyboard down. Once you have lifted the top part of the keyboard up, rest the keyboard face down on the trackpad and palm rest. Using a small Phillips head screwdriver, take out the four screws holding down this shield. With the screws removed, we can remove the shield to reveal the memory socket. Now this is the time you want to find out the speed and the capacity of memory that your iBook can be upgraded to. This can be easily done by looking on Mac Tracker or any other websites with iBook information. My iBook supports up to 1.5GB of PC2700 memory. iBooks have 128MB, 256MB or 512MB built in. My 2005 model has 512MB built in, meaning I can install a 1GB module to max out the RAM to 1.5GB. Before you insert your memory module, touch the metal plate to discharge any static electricity to prevent damage to components. Insert the module and line it up with its socket. Now push the module down until the snaps on either side clamp the module down. To reassemble the iBook, start by placing the shield into its position. Now screw the four small Phillips head screws into their positions. Gently flip the keyboard back up with the plastic clips going down into their divots underneath the palm rests. Push the rest of the keyboard down making sure both of the small spring loaded clips clip down into place. Now turn the lock into its locked position. Please go follow me on Instagram at techwithsully for news on what I purchase and information on upcoming videos. Thanks for watching this video, I hope this has helped you out. As always, remember to hit the like button and get subscribed to keep up to date with all my latest videos.